So welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another cleaning motivation video thank you so much guys for stopping by if you're new hi and welcome my name is Gugu. i am a housewife and a mom so in my channel guys you're gonna find lots of holes the eight grocery hauls homey hauls and uh, i do a lot of cooking inspirational videos mostly low budget meals and tons and tons of cleaning motivation videos so don't forget to hit the bell and the subscribe button before you head out so guys on today's video i'm doing a cleaning motivation video this was in the morning i'm gonna try and do a little bit of some deep cleaning here in the here and there i won't do like the whole kitchen i think i'll split it out into two or three sections today i'm gonna tackle some areas and then on the other um, on the next video i'm gonna be tackling the remaining places that i'm not gonna tackle today and i've shown you guys how i pick mia's lunch boxes i don't pack the same meals every day it changes sometimes i just Put simple stuff and also it depends on what she wants to eat on that certain day because I've seen most of the times if I just pick what's in my head she won't eat that food she'll spend the whole day without eating so I've made peace with that one I've told myself that I'm gonna give you what she wants to eat
thank you so much for clicking on my video so right now i'm cleaning my air fryer guys i'm, I'm even embarrassed to show you this because it's so dirty it really needed some love but we're gonna tackle that that is why um i do these videos guys the purpose of it is to motivate each other As for the range wood guys i'm not gonna lie to you and tell you that i clean this on a daily basis no i do it sometimes once a week or maybe three times a month 
it depends on how you know sometimes guys we forget these things <laughs> we forget these things but i do it i think three to four times a month so i did soak my stove last night after preparing dinner so right now these are the touch-ups you know i'm going in with my scrub daddy and the plush cream ceramic cooktop cleaner that one i bought it from checkers and in those uh, areas where i see the paint on stuff on the stove i'm going in with my hulu's kitchen spray So now let's get on to the workout. I call this one a workout because I have to be on my knees and there's gonna be some scrubbing and scrubbing and scrubbing. So to me, this is a workout. So what I usually do guys, I heat up my oven a little bit for like some few seconds and then I close it. After that, I go in with my oven spray. Any oven spray guys you can find. Today I'm using the Zeb. The Zeb I usually buy it from checkers but i'm sure you can find it even from clicks macro any supermarket that you buy your groceries from so i'm gonna close it and uh, leave it for some time maybe 30 minutes then i'm going in with the brush you know it comes out you know all the paint on stuff you know the caked on food inside your oven is gonna come out very easy once you do that so do the trick you heat up your oven a little bit don't heat it up like too much guys just warm it up and then you go in with any oven cleaner you you close it and then you leave it in maybe for like 30 minutes and then you start the scrubbing the even whatever it's there it's gonna come out very easy i'm not gonna lie to you guys and say i use baking soda and vinegar that takes so much time and i don't know that kind of time so that is why i buy any oven cleaner it does the job so now i'm wiping down i'm done scrubbing everything i just used my 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 brush and my sponge that was it so everything was easy to scrub off so now i'm wiping it down with the clean microfiber cloth so in my water i've changed the water i've poured in a little bit of vinegar just for that freshness to kill off that smell of the chemical i'm using my warm water with the dishwashing liquid and some vinegar even in the hot time you and i can weather many
now on to the unloading the dishwasher i don't like doing this guys but i don't have a choice i have to do it and i do it on a daily basis <laughs> i don't wanna lie guys the dishwasher makes my life so easy but when it comes to unloading i just don't like doing this <laughs> i don't like doing this sometimes I, I send mia to do it though she won't pay my dishes nicely but at least you know she helps me here and there so once i'm done with that one guys i'm gonna start loading again most of the time i load as the day goes by and then i'll run it at night once i'm done with everything at night and it also depends on how many times i cook if i cook breakfast and lunch and also depending on how many people i'm cooking for so you find there's tons of dishes that need to be washed so i'll load the dishwasher and run it during the day but if it's only few dishes i run it at night because dishwashers they use they consume a lot of electricity so i don't have that kind of money to be just running three four plates during the day and at night no 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 no, no. we need to save hey so that is why most of the time you see me loading you see me loading in the morning you see me loading again in the afternoon and at night then i run it once at night So tell me guys, how do you tackle your to-do list? Do you schedule some of your chores as the week goes by? Or it depends with your energy on a certain day. <laughs> For myself, I don't want to lie guys. It depends with the energy and the mood on a certain day. I don't plan my things ahead. 
I don't do that because I, I don't want to pressure myself with, um, especially if you don't meet your target or your goals that you had planned for the day. I don't do that. I used to do that way back, but not anymore. And it also depends with the baby, guys. With the mood for the baby, if he's cooperating on a certain day, then that's a plus for me. I get to tattle a lot of things as the day goes by but on some days most of the days i don't plan my things i just wake up it depends with my mood then i'll see what needs to be done then i'll tackle some of the stuff and then some of them i'll finish them maybe following day or whenever i'm free there's a party downtown we are drunk in the music style it guys for today's clean motivation video thank you so much for cleaning along with me that is if you did and thank you so much for watching my video till this far don't forget to give it a big thumbs up comment down below share and please don't skip those ads support your girl don't skip those ads thank you all so much for watching till next time bye Someone said that you're coming by